So thanks to Oprah, we learned a key lesson last night. Even cycling scandals are boring. Yeah, bike racing hasn't been a sport of interest in America since, um, never. To most Americans, this is like finding out last year's Finnish archery championships were fixed. To us, bicycles are what you ride when you're a kid and what liberal adults ride when the volt won't start again. <laughs> Logic and common sense argue that most, if not all, of Armstrong's competition was juicing, still is. Armstrong was singled out because he won. That's the thing about the rest of the world. They hate this we often win thing America seems to have. Armstrong's great mistake was not being French. Had he been, he'd likely be a national hero. America is just Europe on juice. Yeah, Lance is a jerk who hurt his colleagues and lived a lie, but Dana Perino could be forgiven, so why not Lance? Confession, during my tetherball career, I was juicing constantly, mostly Capri Sun. And for the judgmental media, remember your job, job enhancements. Every editor I know doped too, but they called it booze and Adderall. Clearly, Lance did drugs. We should have known something was wrong when he won his sixth tour to France without ever leaving the hotel room. <laughs> Lance Armstrong, even the guy's name is on steroids. Anyway, I'm just mad Oprah didn't give away free bicycles. <laughs>